If you are a regular Instagram poster, then you already know this. Posting to Instagram can be a real pain in the butt because you have to use your telephone and you cannot schedule it in advance, at least not if you, unless you are using a lot of different apps for that. And still posting from your telephone can be a challenge because typing on your telephone, emojis and stuff like that, icons will be difficult to, uh, to handle. So today I'm going to talk to you about a tool that can save you a lot of time doing just this, posting to a lot of social media networks, including Instagram. Hi, my name is Olaf and I am your tool finder. So why did I need this tool in the first place? Well, I wanted to grow my following for SneakerVisor, my sneaker comparison website on Instagram. So for this, I needed to post a lot of good stuff, obviously. And I tried using my telephone for this and uh, soon I found out that this was taking me way too much time searching for uh, images or videos, uh, checking my text, editing my text, editing my videos, using some filters. So it became somewhat of a frustration to post this via my telephone. And other than that, I didn't want to be uh, busy with posting on Instagram every day. So if you do maybe two or three posts a day, it can take up to an hour maybe to, to do this well. And uh, if you do so, it will break up your entire workday. So I needed something else and I wanted something uh, I could use to maybe start on Monday morning and then schedule all my posts for the entire week, seven days in advance. And another reason is that, um, well, I'm, I'm in this respect, I'm a bit lazy. So instead of trying to find the, the good images and spend hours upon hours to, to do so, uh, I thought there might be a solution where you can just follow your competition and repost good images and stuff whenever you find it. So this is uh, what I set out to do. And that is when I stumbled upon uh, OnlyPult. So what are the benefits of OnlyPult? Well, you can upload your photos and videos to social networks from your PC directly. So using your regular keyboard, using all the tools you have on your PC, which makes this a lot easier. You can manage multiple accounts from one spot. So if you are in the SEO industry or in the social media industry and you are posting for clients, then you can add up to, I don't know how many accounts and manage them all from the same account in OnlyPost. You can follow your favorite accounts uh, to get inspired, but also to see what they are doing and to see what makes um, their video or posts engage or not. And to go even one step further, you could also repost using posts of them. Because if you, for example, you, you like a post, you see you like the image and you can just repost it from OnlyPult and add your own text and hashtags to it. You can analyze your volume and growth, not only in terms of your followers, but also in terms of which of the posts do work best. You can edit images and videos with the built-in editor, so you don't have to have additional uh, tools for this. Just stay in the OnlyPult tool and you can do everything from there. And another nice feature is you can delete posts automatically after a couple of hours. So for example, if you are posting and you want to repost the same one a day later, uh, engaging people again and again, you might set this to 23 hours and just post another one uh, scheduled in a day. You also get insight with the planner and calendar views so you can see in one overview clearly what are your posts for uh, the next week, for example. And another nice feature is that they have a built-in hashtag manager, which means you can store your own frequently used hashtags together with popular hashtags that OnlyPult will supply to you. So with one click, you can just have all the popular food hashtags, all the popular training hashtags, all the popular hashtags in general, maybe fashion, maybe hair. So th those are all built in and with one click, you can edit all those hashtags. If we take a look at the proof, something went wrong over there, we can see that uh, only pool scores very high. For example, here in Trustpilot 4.6, in G2 4.7, and other reviews 4.4, and here 4.5, I would say. So 
So this is a really good score and I can back this up because I have been using Onipult myself for years now and I'm really very happy with uh, how it performs and how easy it is to use. So when we take a look at the calculator or the time saved or extra money you could earn by, by saving you a lot of time by using Onipult, I have three variables in this calculator. So the first one is how many posts do you post per week? And uh, as a default, I entered 14, which is twice a day, which seems to me like pretty standard. And the default time per post would be 10 minutes. This includes uh, searching for images, editing images, editing text, rewriting your text, adding emojis and stuff. So I think 10 minutes is even on the low side, but let's stick with the default 10 minutes for now. And uh, the third variable would be your client fee or your rate per hour, which means if Onipult could save me two hours per week, for example, I could uh, spend those two hours to do some work for clients. So I could earn myself extra income. Or the other way around, I could save myself time and my time is valuable. So if I rate or value my time uh, at example, I don't know, $60 per hour, I can calculate with this calculator how much time and or money I would save per week. And if you would uh, multiply this by 40, you would find your savings per year. And this can be really huge as we will see now. Well, the star here means, of course, editing in Onipult also takes time, but well, I estimate only half of the usual time. It, it might be even less, but let's just stick on the safe side with the half of your usual time. So it calculates, for example, if you choose 10 minutes per post, as we have in this example, it will calculate a saving of five minutes per post using Onipult. I will show you in real life how this works. So let's go to the calculator and I will just scroll down a little bit. So here we see the calculator and the number of posts per week. So let's just figure out the default first, or let's say we do 10 posts per week and we take six minutes per post, which means this would be one hour of uh, work on Instagram posting. And we have a client fee of $60. Normally you would then save or make extra $60. But since we have to spend time in only pulled as well, we calculate as we have explained before, with the half of that. So it's not 60, but it's $30 per week saved or extra income made. So uh, this example, 10 times six is, is one hour and uh, $60 per hour divided by two is 30. So if you go back to the default, that would mean 14 posts per week, twice per day. One post will take you 10 minutes and I charge my customers $100 per hour, then I would have an extra income of $117 per week. And if we go back to 60, it would even uh, be $70 per week, which would translate into $2,800 per year that you could make extra from just using this tool instead of uh, posting manually from your telephone. Um, so as we can see, this can be a huge time and money saver as well. And uh, even when we turn this down to an internal rate, let's say of $30, it would still mean $1,400 per year that you could save by using Onlypult instead of posting manually on Instagram via your telephone. All right. So let's go back to the PowerPoint and start having a look at the tool itself, because as usual, the proof of the pudding is in the eating. So I will show you how Onlypult works right now. So let's go to, where is it? There. So, here we have uh, an account of mine which consists of three different uh, accounts altogether. 
you could have more, but for now I just uh, use this account to show you how only pulled works. And this is the dashboard. And as you can see, there are a couple of things you will notice. We have the posting over here. So if I add a new post and I'll start over here, this is where we are now, the feed in this account. I have my favorites to spy on my competitors and to, to repost maybe nice things I see over here. I have my analytics and I have the general settings. So when I would like to post, I can go to add post. And as you can see, I have two options to add media over here. So I can add media from my local drive, which is standard, or I can use the URL. And this can be very handy because, for example, I'm now looking up images of houseboats on my other screen. I will show you. So let's say I like this one. I could go and click on copy the address of this image. And I would enter this over here and it would just import it in my media, as you can see there. And when you have uploaded this image, you can easily edit it by going to the built-in filters. Uh, so for example, you could transform the image first into the correct dimensions or orientation even, whatever you like. So in this case, I choose five by four and if I want, I can immediately change the filter as well. So let's assume I want black and white. All kinds of different options you can choose right from within the tool. So no need to do funky stuff on your telephone. You can just do this right from within only pulled as well. And here you can see you can adjust them even more nitty gritty. If you want, you can change the focus. You can add text. You can change colors. You can add stickers. You can paint on it. You can add frames to it, for example. So you can do all kinds of nice stuff with the image itself, as you can see. So this is uh, an option using the URL. And other, the other option would be just add media from your local hard drive or external drive or whatever it is. And then I can just start typing over here. Hi, take a look at this awesome. And immediately I could add some of my frequently used emojis, but it's also possible to just look up the emojis in the database of Onipool, which is very handy. Normally you could add hashtags over here, but uh, they recommend putting all the hashtags in the first comment. So for example, I could use these are the, the regular default hashtags that I use for this account. So I already have them entered and I just add them all. And in this case, all the hashtags will be added instantly. And as you can see, of course, you can type whatever you want in here. And you could also add or check the delete after box. So for example, as I mentioned in my PowerPoint, I could set this to 24 hours and if I select the date and time that I want to, to schedule this post. For example, this would be today at, uh, let's say eight o'clock. Then this would, this message, this post would be deleted tomorrow at eight o'clock exactly. So what I could do then is just repost this same post for tomorrow, uh, five past eight, and we will get a new post in this account for the same uh, image and text, or we could change it, of course, if we like, but then you don't have the same post in your account twice. 
which is a really neat feature. Um, another thing is we can go to the feed that we already have in this account. So you can just have a good overview of the engagement and the comments. And if you want, you can repost the same one again well, without a problem. So if I just click on it, I could clone it and do it again. So this would be a nice option. And you could also open it with Instagram to see how it will look uh, on Instagram itself. And obviously it's uh, possible to add stories or IGTV as well. Another feature that I use a lot is the favorites, as I mentioned. In this case, you can have up to, I think, 10 favorites in this account, but it depends on the plan you have. And uh, it's very neat and easy to use because um, if you are looking for nice images or videos to repost, you just have to look up a couple of nice competitors first and just check what they have posted. So for example, in this case, I could go down a little bit and say, okay, um, I really enjoy this image. For example, I could just repost it, put it in the right account, and then OnlyPult will just add it to my account. And then I would obviously change the text and add my default hashtags again. And here you can type in your own text. Oh, no, one text. Own oh, text. Like that. So, in my case, this is what I use only pulled for. You can also use it for all the other social media, but for my, this, for me, this is the most important uh, part of it. Just posting it in advance and using favorites to spy upon your competitors. So, for example, um, I could search for, let's say, uh, a username. I will go to Instagram first and I will show you how to do this. So if I would go to Instagram and I would look for houseboat, for example, so let's say I found this one and I think eh, I would say, okay, this is interesting for me to, to follow. I would just copy the username and find it in only pulled. And in this case, I would add it to my favorites. And you can see it has been added to my favorites. So my tracked users now would be three instead of two, as you can see over here. And here you see it now follows this house motel. And the, the great thing about this is that if you have like 10 different competitors from maybe your own country, but also other countries, you really get inspired and you really can repost things really quickly. So for example, if I would scroll down now and I would say, all right, this is a really great one. I can just repost it and Bob's your uncle. You're done pretty quickly. So I'll delete it for now because this is not really the one that I want to follow, but you get the point. Well, in your analytics, you can see the development of your account, obviously. So this is also a nice feature and it's pretty stable. As you can see this uh, houseboat real estate agent, um, but uh, well, you can just choose your own setting. And as you can see in, in this period, we did campaign to increase the number of followers and you can see the growth of followers following etc in this analysis so i hope you like this uh, to, to summarize only pulled is a great great tool it will save you a lot of time and money by just posting it from your pc instead of doing all the nitty-gritty stuff on your telephone and i can wholeheartedly recommend it to all of you guys. See you later.